Hi, and welcome to this week's video of the week. This week we're focusing on the commenting feature in Google Docs. Google Docs has a quick way to tag people individually so that they are notified about any comments you make on a document. To do this, you would select a point in the document for the comment. So I'm going to scroll down to the bottom of this document where um, maybe I want to have another teacher I'm working with add a link to something that she created. So to insert my comment here, I would place my cursor next to the text, and then from the top, select Insert and Comment. So that will get you the comment box. You can also select the text, and a shortcut would be using your keys and selecting Command, Option, and the letter M. In the comments box is where you would write notes or feedback. The unique part about tagging though is before I actually leave my comment, I might want to alert someone specifically about this comment. So I can hit return and the key here is to use either the at sign or the plus sign. So I'm going to use the plus sign and start typing the email of uh, someone that I'm collaborating with. So I'm going to select their email and once I hit comment they will receive an email that alerts them of my comment. This is how you would tag someone in a comment. In addition to tagging, you can also assign actions to a person. This comes in handy especially when you're working with students and you want to provide them feedback in which you expect them to make adjustments um, based on. The person tagged will receive an email informing them of the assigned action. So to assign an action to someone, I would select the box that self-generates at the bottom of the comment. So I'm going to select that box. So now the person will receive an email just like they would if they were tagged. But in addition to this, when I hit Assign, now they have an option to mark the task complete um, once it's been taken care of. Once they've taken care of the assigned action and marked it complete, the other person in the Google Doc who assigned the action will receive an email alerting them that this has been taken care of. The combination of tagging with assigning actions is especially helpful when you have a document that has more than two collaborators. It can also cut down on your wait time for adjustments to be made to a document. The same method applies when tagging someone in comments using Google Sheets and Google Slides. Thanks for watching and I hope this helped.